Now let's move to the vaccination campaign. More than 62% of Taiwan is now fully vaxxed. More than 78% has had at least one shot. The numbers are ticking up fast this week as supermarkets, department stores and train stations offer shots to walk-ins. Since starting vaccinations on December 5th, Taipei Main Station has vaccinated 8,888 people. Taipei City has launched a campaign to boost vaccine coverage. Taipei Expo Park now offers drop-in appointments for Moderna vaccines. Get a shot there and you'll also receive a 100 NT voucher. The city announced the program Wednesday evening, saying 1,000 doses would be offered the next day. But as of 4 p.m. on Thursday, only 436 people had showed up. We only announced the plan last night. I remember that on its first day, almost nobody went to get vaccinated at Taipei Main Station at the beginning of the day. It was only in the afternoon and evening that crowds started forming. The deputy mayor says that more people will turn up as they had at the Taipei Main Station clinic set up by the CCC. It's a stark difference between the two venues. Both sites offer 100 NT vouchers and Moderna vaccines. In its first three days, about 5,600 people got vaccinated at Taipei Main Station. But during that same time frame, Taipei City's hospital drop-in program administered just 1,309 shots. That's less than 100 people per vaccination site. Citing safety reasons, Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe says his administration will not open up clinics at department stores and supermarkets as the CECC has done. But the CECC says that such clinics are driving up the vaccination rate fast. Yesterday at Taipei Main Station, we administered 3,238 vaccines. So altogether, a total of 8,888 have been administered for eight. It's convenient, for me at least. Over at Banqiao Station in New Taipei, there were hour-long queues for a shot. Over the past week, about 91,000 people received their first shot of a COVID vaccine, pushing one dose coverage past 78 percent. On its first day of operations, the Taipei Main Station Clinic vaccinated more than 800 people, 70 percent of whom were receiving their first shot. It's now administering more than 2,700 doses per day. Overall, the site is expected to administer about 15,000 doses before it closes. Over at Banqiao Station, about 200 doses were administered Wednesday evening. Almost half of them were first shots. Train stations in Tainan and Taoyuan have also opened up drop-in vaccine clinics. Planning is underway to set one up in Kaohsiung. Starting January 1st, 59 kinds of workers will have to be fully vaccinated or get tested routinely to go to work. On Thursday, the CECC addressed accusations that it was not giving these workers enough notice. Actually, more than 95 percent of these workers have received one shot of a COVID vaccine, and two-shot coverage is also quite high, at about 90 percent. The CECC says it's confident its drop-in clinics at public spaces will boost vaccine coverage in Taiwan.